Okay, question 11 says write in the missing numbers. So in this column here, we've got our numbers 5.05, 5.55, 4.45 and 4.54. And we're asked here, it says rounded to the nearest whole number. So the first thing we've got to do is to decide which is the nearest whole number. If we look on here, we can think of this as being our units in this column. Then we've got our tenths and then our hundredths. So thinking about place value here. The whole number is going to be the unit part here. So in this case, we've got 5.05. Now, we can probably see that 5.05 is quite close to 5. But let's use our method of rounding. So when we're rounding, we look at the number we need to round and then we look at the next digit to help us decide. So in this case, we're going to look at the number in the tenths column to help us decide. When we're rounding, if this number is five or more, we round up, but if it's less than five, we stay the same. So here it's zero, which is less than five. That means we're going to stay the same. So our answer is five. Let's use that same method again here. So we've got 5.55. So 5.55 lies between 5 and 6, but we need to decide which it's closer to. So we look at the number that we need to round, and we look at the next digit to decide. Because it's 5, we round up, so this becomes 6. Looking at the next one, we've got 4.45. So we look at our units, our whole number, we look at the next digit in the tenths column to decide. This is less than 5, so we're going to stay the same. And then looking to this last one, again, this is the number we want to round, our whole number. We look at the next number to help us decide. Because it's 5, that means we round up, so this becomes 5. So we've got our answers here. Let's just take a quick look at what we've got. So we can look in this first row. It says 5.05, and that is indeed closer to 5. Another way of thinking about it would be to think of it as being 5 pounds. 5 pounds and 5 pence is in fact closer to 5. Let's think of this one the same way. 5 pounds 55, that would be closer to 6 pounds. 4 pounds 45 would be closer to 4 pounds. And 4 pounds 54 would be closer to 5 pounds. So we're just checking now that we've got a correct answer.